we go. Okay. Gonna get right into it tonight. Go. Oh, damn. Pop right away. <laughs> what we got? Oh my god, it's the goggles again. Hey, Keith. Me up too. Oh, you know, but to play some Monster Hunter. Oh, you're really low right now. Uh, uh I shouldn't again? be. Okay, no, you're fine. It was on my end. I fixed nah, it. Fair enough. Yeah. Okay, goggles. Where are my goggles? I'm uh, put them. Not those goggles. The big goggles. Big goggles. There we go. <laughs> All right. Anyways, how's how's things going? Oh, you know, you know, mm. I'm playing a lot of Xenoblade. Nice. Yeah, it's been going good. Yeah, it's been fantastic, actually. Excellent. Um, Excellent. If I had one no. complaint, I guess, aside yeah. from the one that we discussed earlier, which I'm not going to talk about on stream. Yeah, spoiler alert. Um, <laughs> you post. I, what? what? Oh, you, okay. You post. You keep talking. You pick a like, kind of thing. Previous Xenoblade games have had a lot of mechanics. Yeah. This one keeps adding more. Yeah, it's that dense. So on. many things. Oh. The menus just keep getting bigger. Really? Oh. Yes. Mm -mm. Like too dense, would you say? Or like, it's just like a lot of good thing. <laughs> well, there's a whole bunch of different menus that do little things. OK. And like they could have put them all together. Yeah. But because this game is supposed to kind of be like a bit of an amalgamation of the previous two games. Right. It's just all there. Xenoblade, Chron or Xenoblade 1 and 2 or Xenoblade X and 2? <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure X doesn't exist. OK. <laughs> so it's 1 and 2. <laughs> OK. I was about to say, I was about to say, previous two games could be could mean two things in that series. <laughs> no, no, it's 1 and 2. It's definitely one and two. Okay, you charge your joy cons while me and Keith will do some hopping. <laughs> also, hey Rock, how you doing? Uh, yeah. Um, I'm just gonna post a random anomaly quest. Yeah, yeah go for it. I am totally down for that. Yeah. Uh, sounds like a plan. Let's fight. Let's fight a anomaly puke puke because I haven't done that. Yet. Okay. Sounds like a sounds like a plan. Just like figuring out my like alignment here. There we go. Pookie Pookie, what's Pookie Pookie weak to? Fire? Oh, getting punched in the face. Okay. Gotcha. So that's why you've picked a lance, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean that's basically what a lance does, so I mean it's not wrong. <laughs> I'm gonna say it's fire. I feel like it's fire. Yeah. But it shouldn't take long. Okay, no worries, White. Uh, just check right quick. Not that it matters too much. It's a pookie poop. But thunder, actually. Second weakness is no. nice. I wouldn't have guessed that. I've also been working on a new bug stick build. Oh, yeah. One that deals with explosions, but not your normal ch just blast explosions. Oh, yeah. There's a, a new type of insect. That I haven't really explored. Yeah. No. That uh, no. can suck in all of the dust that the insect puts out. Oh. And just make it explode. Like, to the tune of a thousand damage explode. Yeah. Okay. Gotcha. Thousand damage. That's pretty good. This is for a bug stick. Yeah. yeah. That it's is. It's, it's all really like high. you can technically play this bug stick all range. Hmm. Interesting. Yes, yeah, it's, it's actually really neat. Huh. Oh, cool. See, I've been playing around with weapons and whatnot. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Yeah. Pretty much, I'm just playing live at the at this point, so it's like well, I haven't messed around too much off stream lately. Okay. Yeah. Wait, wait, I'm like, where am I going? Am I going? I'm not 
I'm not even remotely in the right place. <laughs> Where do I go? What do I do? <laughs> yeah. I should look into getting that pro controller. Yes, absolutely. Do it. Yeah. It's like, gosh. A different sound. I guess this is probably hitting your shield. Oh, thank you for the cheese. Thank you, Sarah. Yeah, startles me. <laughs> but not in a bad way. Fortunately, I have my cheese goggles on, so. <laughs> no risk of cheese based injuries. Oh, that's such a beautiful little drawing strike there. It's gorgeous. Like, what do I fucking do with this weapon now? I forget. It's been a week. I've forgotten how to play. Oh, f fuck. Just nailed me with it. Okay, fine. Fight you down. No, 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 don't run away. Don't run away. No, come back. Where are you going? What are you doing? Yeah, Get his Bring him back down here. Get over here. Get over here. We gotta get him down here. Okay. Trust me, it's I'm a good plan. I gotta block this. Okay. It's a good plan. Uh, I'm all ready. Ooh. Oh my god! Woo! Okay, yeah, this is a pretty good plan. I guess it was one of the anomaly points. Whatever. Oh, my god. My health. Ah, Samurai, how you doing? Took it like a champ, thank you. I always do. Just like my blood test today. Yeah. I only screamed a little. I'm not even, oh, fuck. I'm, ow. <laughs> I'm not even kidding, like literally, like whenever they do my blood, like, I'm at the point now where I don't get faint or don't have any issues like that, but I do warn them every single time. I'm like, okay, when the needle goes in, I might, I might yelp. <laughs> like, I might scream a little. So, just because I feel like it, I don't want them to, like, jump while they're doing it, right? So I feel like it's a fair warning. Also, if I didn't say it, hey, Wang. Walls. Um, Fair enough. Oh, put this lance away. <laughs> oh my god. Ooh, I almost didn't make it to that wall. Where are you there going? Go. I was trying to make sure that I could get to the walls and they were all like on the same side. Sorry, it was really awkward looking, I know. As long as I don't see the needle, I'm fine. Yeah, and see, like, that's the thing. It's like, I'm obviously not gonna look at the needle. That's like. Actually, you know what? That's not entirely true. The last time I had a blood test, I actually watched her do it. That was the first time I've ever done that. And it was actually interesting. It's done differently than I thought it was. And now it goes. Yeah. Observe the needle as she pierces. No, I didn't observe that part, but I did watch like the tubes fill. I'm like, oh, faster than I expected. Sucking all that blood out. I know. It's like a little pump thing going on. And it's like, oh, unexpected. I don't know yeah, why. Kinda... I did. I don't know why. Like I, I knew it was like a thing, but it was just like, no, it does not make a slurp sound. <laughs> no, stop it. Jesse, no, 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 no. No, that is not the sound it makes. I'm pretty sure it is. That's that definitely not. That's definitely not the sound the machine makes. 
They have a speci very specific. <laughs> That's just the motor. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Okay. Sounds right to me. It's last. Oh, sleep. Oh, I I have uh, I have my strike. I can do my big shot. Yeah. Right. Uh, I can be. Oh. Okay. But but. Uh. 1,700. I spaced it right too. I'm really proud of that. I think that's the first time I ever spaced it correctly. Usually I end up hitting the second hit by accident. Ooh. I like that it was just about to do a thing and then it exploded. <laughs> also, how's the volumes, everybody? Is the volume levels good? Shit, I just feel like. Okay, being captured is there. If it's too loud, y'all give me a heads up. Volume's fine? Okay. Yeah. Ooh, that was so much faster than I was ready for. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, My cat just. Bug? Yeah, go for it. So, I've been playing a game. It's probably not, like, in your wheelhouse, but I feel like I should mention it just because I'm actually enjoying it a lot. Okay. Uh, what you got? Multiverses. Have you seen it? Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm actually kind of surprised. Um, it's it's hear, really good. I've been hearing good things about it. Yeah, it, like, takes a lot of problems that... Uh, I never felt like there were problems with Smash, but I feel like they... I feel like... It's things that Smash has added over the years that's contributed to it being like less fun to play, and it's like addressed a lot of those things. So I'm like, oh, it's pretty good. Fair enough. Yeah. Like, I find like over time movement in Smash got like way too like punishable, and like, yep. like, Multiverses feels so like with its movement that you just can kind of do like that isn't where you get punished right it's taking right. the focal point off of that and put it on actually getting punished for doing stupid moves which feels more right to me yeah and the movement's just so good lots of like emphasis on like going into the air to do your aerials for what this one was bad <laughs> yeah that is a very red yeah. A lot of emphasis on 2v2 and just like character synergy, which is fun. Uh, I hear Bugs Bunny's the best character. Um, I don't know. Bugs seems really good. Bugs is like fun. I I haven't had. I think right now, if I was to like pick a best character, I'd pick Finn. But I really like Finn, so it's just like a, it's just like that might just be bias. Uh, the reason I've been like, hearing yeah. Bugs is the best character because that's really like all the tournament players are using. Ah, uh, interesting. Like, I can definitely understand it because Bugs does have, like, some good good normals mixed with some other stuff, but, yeah. I think Finn is generally regarded as quite good. Finn is, like, a mixture of fucking, uh, Krom, Link, and Shulk, which is an insane thing to say. Oh. But there's, like, some fun stuff, and it's not, like, limiting it itself to trying to be, like, Smash Brothers. Like, yeah. there's just some, like, innate mechanics, which are just, like, it's like, oh, this is, like, just character-specific. Finn knocks coins out of characters so he can use his, basically, uh, Monado <laughs> when you have enough Fair money. Enough. And it's just, like, that's that's cool. That It's just, like, it's its own thing. But it's hard to say. I don't know who would be best in it. It's... I haven't, I haven't played any characters that feel like, like, oh, you know... I haven't found any character that feels like, oh, this character is distinctly a problem, like, every time. Yeah. Yeah. No, I'm just going by what I've yeah. no, heard. No, absolutely. Absolutely. No. Bugs, Bugs feels good. Um, like I said, I... The thing is, is his specials have really, really high cooldowns, so I have no idea how they would shake out, but... Uh, it seems, seems solid. I mean, doing the big, dumb move. Yeah. Also free to play, so that's pretty nice. Like, and yeah, the price to actually. enter is really good. So, you know, just easy to try. Yeah, exactly. So I was pretty pleased about it. Dio's really into it. 
It's like literally the only game he wants to play right now, I think. I see. Yeah, no, like literally like we've been like playing matches oh, practically daily. So it's like, oh, this is this is nice that it's like kind of you know, and digging into that together. Cool. Fair enough. Yeah. I think he's with me, like literally he's like this game feels better than Smash. <laughs> Interesting. Like it's just a case of like a game that like it feels like all the things they, they tried to do to make like Smash more like competitive oriented, but like kind of took away from its fun that they just they were like, nah, you don't have to do that. Fair enough. Yeah, like giving giving more free movement and stuff like that and making you know that sort of thing. Also hits are very like you have to land like really definitive hits to like take someone out you have a lot of like um uh like what do you call it like when you're recovering in the air the air chase isn't as strong in this game as it is in smash it's still good but it's like they have to really land a clean hit it's not right. like it's not like you're the feeling you get in ultimate where like you're up in the air and it's like how am i ever going to get to the fucking ground <laughs> because for some reason I want to say it's because you get a lot of left and right horizontal uh, movement on air tech. Yeah. So you can really tech go to things that's really hard for the person on the ground to read which direction you're going to go and react. So. All right. Yeah, so they have to be really on the ball to do good air chase. But yeah, kind of interesting. Um, I feel like, what else have I been playing lately? Um, you mostly just been playing Xenoblade Chronicles, right? Yep, that, and I've still been pretty late. Yeah, I have some new buffs. Right, how's it been? Good. Good. Yeah. I've seen like little bits and pieces here online, and it's just, it looks excellent. I have to admit, like, I've been like, I know it's probably not my type of game, but it's oh, on Game Pass. Absolutely not. Yeah, the first game's on Game Pass. I'm kind of tempted just to play it on my own time. I mean, I really like them, yeah. but. Admittedly, as much as I love the games, I yeah. don't like them as much as the creator's previous games. Ah, uh, catch of the, uh, what was it? Uh, 999. Nine, nine, like the Zero Escape yeah. series and whatnot. Yeah. 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 And that's mostly because Those it's much more... less... It, it's much less puzzle-oriented. Yeah, I was about to say, it was. Those games were way more puzzly, weren't they? And the puzzles in those games were, like, straight-up devious. Like, yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm really about, like... The puzzles. Give, give me the stupidly hard puzzles. Yeah. Give me it's puzzles that I need to pull out a pen and paper and I'm happy. Oh, yeah. It is kind of a good feeling when you have to, like, take out the pad of paper and be like, okay, let me work this out. Because, <laughs> like, you know, then you're dealing with something that's, like, <laughs> kind of a lot. There we go. Um, yeah, this is the guy. Thank you for the sub. How you doing? What are you up to? Oh. Hope everything is well. Oh, my God, it's been eight months. Thank you so much. Yeah. Also, the Hitchhiker, how's things going? Yeah. Helmst, the monster's code. Well, this is our first monster of the night. It's going pretty good, I'd say. It's... Boy, I'd this say. feels like it has a million health, though, for Pookie Pookie. Well, all the monsters they that are yeah. afflicted yeah. have, like, a bajillion four times as much health. Yeah. Not much? I've got a case of swimmers here. Oh. But were you swimming? Yeah. That might be like a silly question. I don't know. I feel like you can nah. get swimmers here from a few things, though. So. Uh, oh yeah, gotcha. Okay, gotcha. I'm not sure what you can do for swimmers here. I feel like it's like something you has this, you just lay, tend to lay down and like on that side, and the water will like eventually come out. If that's what it's swimmers here is, maybe I'm like off base on that. <laughs> It's like when your like ear gets like locked up with water, yeah. Yeah. You can get tennis elbow, but not from ten playing tennis. Oh yeah, that's like super easy. I remember getting tennis elbow all the time in karate. Fucking sucks. I'm just I'm just like really vigorous with my punches. <laughs> what? What? You never saw me. I was I was I was, I was fierce. Overextending? I'm fiercely overextending. Yes. 
You're right. You're, you're going the wrong direction. Shit. <laughs> okay, that's okay. It's okay. Puka Puka is over here. He's doing his Puka Puka stuff. Yeah. Looks like he's about to explode. Yeah. No, I get better about not hyper extending. I, I did that. No, it's water, uh, water based ear infection. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Oh, gotcha. So I take it you have to be on antibiotics for that. I don't know if you can get the good stuff that. They make this like yellow medicine that you can take for it. It's insane. I could drink that stuff by the gallon. <laughs> Maybe not the gallon, but it's very good. Generally, drinking medicine is a bad idea. Just I know, but it's so good. <laughs> I'm like, I'm like, if Canada, what is Canada's free health care for if I can't even fucking drink uh, fucking ear infection medicine? Disappointing. The system has failed me. <laughs> This just failed me, Keith. How am I, I supposed to prevent an ear infection? How, how am I supposed to prevent an ear infection if I can't drink ear infection medicine every day? I love my banana medicine. I do. It tastes like bananas. I can't sleep. Oh, oh. I can't sleep well unless it's in VR. Oh, gosh. Unless it's in VR where it's extremely common. I can see that. Like, VR is something that, like, you know, uh, it's, like, very encompassing, which I think could really make it quite helpful for sleeping. Which is probably really something they should probably consider doing a study on. It's, like, it's it's very, like, all-encompassing. I suggest mine was. Yeah, I've, like over the last like couple of years, I've gotten really used to like listening to music when I'm uh, sleeping. Supposedly that's not a good habit to get into, but I'm like, it's you. Oh god, the bomb! Well, it's been low for a little bit, so any any day now. Oh. Yeah, it shouldn't have much longer. No. Although, with their health being so stacked in this game. Yeah, it's really hard to tell. Come back. I'm done yet. Oh. Feel my bones. This is it. Oh, never mind. My bones are wrong. Let me listen to some other bones. Maybe they'll know better. Yeah. Uh. pack a uh, banana ear medicine. <laughs> How will that be delivered? <laughs> directly into my direct veins. Yeah, no, into my mouth. I can't taste it if it goes directly into my veins. Get some of them vein buds for your taste. Vein buds. No, that's not a thing. I hope it's not a thing. The biz is gonna explode. Ah! <laughs> oh, okay. Need to heal up. I just fell off a cliff. That one hurt. Hey, next month I'm getting a PC. Hey, very good, very good. Oh, well, good luck with your uh, PC. What is he doing over there? Why is he going there? Main buds brought to you by your code and friends. You're welcome. <laughs> yeah, really. Brought to you by Key. Don't don't put this one on me. No, no. This one's. I'm giving this one to Code. It, it's a gift to you. This is the worst <laughs> worst birthday present I've ever received. <laughs> You're welcome. Uh. <laughs> you know. Mm -hmm. I'm realizing something. Yeah, what's up? Lance in multiplayer sucks. Yeah, the it's a really good solo thing because like the monsters stay like right on you, right? Multiplayer well, I can stay, on, I can stay mm -hmm. on its head so easily in single player. Yeah. Oh, exactly. Yeah. Is this the goalie all over again? I don't think so. Probably. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Oh. 
Here I am looking for my charge attack and a Jaggy decides to run my day. Hmm. I don't have enough meter. So. 800 damage. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's still really good. Yeah. Breaking those parts. Because then this would pop up. This would thing had to yell in my ears. Oh, thank you. Oh, I like ledge tacked. It's pretty sick. Aww. Oh my goodness, thank you. Also, I assume Keed is good and audible, yes. No, I fell off this tiny ledge. Bring him down to me. I have damage. <laughs> I have damage to give. Oh, never mind, I fucking missed. What? Oh, he's dead. I glanced, I glanced away for two seconds and he died. I stabbed him in the tail. Oh. I think I might have to go with like a faster mobility build to play this lens with you. Okay. Keed, Keed is present and vibrant. Aw. <laughs> and vibrant. Yeah. That's not a word used to describe it very often. Mm. Oh my goodness, I just realized something. What did you realize? Just one sec, I have to have to go find a thing. Um, uh, just trying to, there we go. I almost forgot. We have a portrait of you that we can use on the stream now. <laughs> what? Okay. How <laughs> were it? Oh, yes. <laughs> Yeah, there's Pokemon announcements today. New key dropped. <laughs> you know, I'm okay with this. <laughs> it's it's intense side bang, Keed. It is intense side bang. <laughs> like a that is top quality character design right there. Yeah, I'm like that's a good that's a that's a good new key. <laughs> so how many keys do we have now? I don't know. It's a lot. It's a lot. There's you you there's an archetype of characters that's just like I'm like that's keyed. <laughs> it's just like it's the first thing I point out. Like that one character in Elden Ring. Oh, um It was like in the basement and threw its cape off and you're like, oh my god, Keed, what are you doing here? Oh actually there was like two characters in Elden Ring that I would be like I'm pretty sure there was two characters that I would distinctly have said I'm like, oh my god, Keed. <laughs> That was one of them. The other one is actually you take it probably as an immense compliment if you knew the character. Okay. Do you care about Elden Ring spoilers? Nah, show me. Show you? Or like, tell me. It's okay, okay, basically there's this guy at the end of the game that's basically just this um how to explain it. Um He's basically the former like Elden Lord. Right. And he's just he was just away in another country and then he's back and he literally just like fucking he fucking is wearing a fucking lion as a cape and he just fucking hucks his lion cape off and then he suplexes you. <laughs> like he has an axe. He could fucking kill you with the axe. No, he fucking sticks the axe on the ground and goes hand to hand. <laughs> this axe is in the way. I want to make this personal. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, when he threw the axe down, I was like, oh my god! <laughs> See, weapons are great, but punching is personal. Yeah, it's true. It's like, if you want to do somebody in yeah. with your bare hands, you gotta yeah. work for it. Yeah. They will know you meant it. Yeah, really. Uh, what's his name? I, uh, uh, I what is this cheap tool I'm holding? Oh! Oh, hey, wait. There you are. Mm. Yeah. It's you. It's me. You made it. I did. My my controllers are charged enough. It'll be fine. Yeah. I would hope. Yeah. Go. There we go. Hello. Your hands are vastly too large to be eating that dongo. No. What now? He's critiquing my dongo eating. I'm like, no, I will not I'm have that. I'm not critiquing oh. your dongo eating. You ate those masterfully. It's your hands that are too big for the dongo. I'll fight you. 
<laughs> okay. Anyways, yeah, so anyways, this was, <laughs> this was like Elden Ring keyed. There we go. Yeah. Literally has a JoJo stand too, which is basically a lion cape phantom. I like ghost. it. Yeah, I know. Right? I He's, like it a lot. I'm like, this is a fucking character you would make in character creation. <laughs> And nobody would question it. Well, he's old and yoked, so yeah. Yeah, yeah exactly. Literally, I was just, the whole time I was just like, this is a keyed fight. This is a fucking keyed fight. Like, my whole drive for getting old is just so I can be old and yoked. Yeah. yeah. That's, that's good goals, though. That's good goals to take into, like, to age with, you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. I'm like... Damn it, I had a picture of white here. Where is it? There we go. Like, if I ain't ancient, bearded, and terrifyingly huge, then I'm just not doing it right. Oh, there we go. There. I've put you both in here. Ha ha! Uh, okay. All right. Um. Not correct. I am taller than white in this. Yeah, the proportions are off. Photos can be taken at different distances or something. I don't know. Cause yeah. all you have to do, all you have to do is just elevate my avatars or my and my image just a little bit higher than Keats. It's fine. Yeah, but then it goes into the actual screen. Lower Keats. <laughs> <laughs> Lower Keats. <laughs> no more than two minutes. No more than like a minute into the chat, and White's already picking fights. Um, White, White's come into the chat. She's got the trash can ready and said, Keen, I found your home. Yeah, really? <laughs> um, it is your pick, White. You're just seeing a dongo. It's just too easy. Not if you count the ears. Mm. Yeah, Vapor, how you doing? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. We're just like chilling out on some Monster Hunter right now. Yeah, murder the monsters. Yeah, so you pick something out, okay, White? Okay. Hmm. Oh yeah. Spin, 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 spin. Is that to spin, 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 spin? Oh, I accidentally deleted it. Go around my cat. Spin around my cat. There we go. Just put this like right here. Pose. Golden around my cat, good her run around my cat at post. <laughs> oh yeah, I also played Stray. Stray was really cute. I've been hearing mixed reviews about that one. It's like it's not gonna be for everybody. It's definitely like a play as the experience kind of play as an experience game. It's kind of yeah. like Journey, where it's like the game itself is like mm. all right, but it's like it's like mostly just the experience of it. Oh. The achievement chase is pretty good in it, though. Oh, ooh, uh, okay. okay. <laughs> um, get my gun. <laughs> Jeez, oh, everyone gets that silent all of a sudden. Uh, I'm pretty sure there was a lot of O's going there. That was not silence. Yeah, but you guys were in the middle of chatting and then all of a sudden it's like, yeah. oh. It got serious. <laughs> That's why. Well, so thunder and then uh, this nice. ain't no joke. And Kushala is definitely an issue. Okay, so it's thunder and ice. Uh, Espa Espa Chados is weak to ice and Kushala's thunder. Espa Nas. Espa Nas. The name you can't say without singing it. Oh. Um, after a while eating dongos, it's just too easy. I kind of like dongos. Uh, uh, what, huh. what do I eat? What do I, what do I eat when I gun? Um, what? I eat for ice resist. He's having a panic attack, so yeah. like... I haven't gunned in a while. I forgot what I do. <laughs> ah. I've been playing like every weapon, but the main weapon I've been using in this game. Yeah. Sometimes you just gotta not use the bullets, and sometimes you gotta take mm. a stick and put it into the monster in, in oh. an uncomfortable way for everybody. Oh. Sexually. No. Oh. <laughs> I said uncomfortable for everybody. Oh, yeah, that's right. They'll be comfortable with someone. Hopefully. Hopefully comfortable with someone. 
hopefully comfortable for we've, everybody. You know what? We've really, we really, we really are like on brand with our like armor picks. Well, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Really, really on brand here today. I mean, I walk up, coming up, rocking into the club, and just go, "Welcome <laughs> to Keen." God. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going Welcome. to the bathroom. I just walk in front of you. To Keen. Oh my God. What? What? There's no. There's no like showboating animation. Welcome. He's making Welcome. his own. Welcome. Welcome. <laughs> you go this way, which is behind Keed, so you can watch Keed walk away. <laughs> Laura Keed's uh, image, please. <laughs> In the sunset goes Keed. Where is the sun? Why is it not setting for Keed? <laughs> <laughs> the sun is set for Keed. <laughs> Fucking confirm your mission, goddammit. <laughs> Okay, it has it. There it is. There we go. <laughs> Sorry, I was too busy being me. <laughs> yeah, I, I noticed. <laughs> Everyone noticed. <laughs> yeah. I don't think enough people noticed. Oh. Well, all right, your viewer count should have tripled for that one. Mm. Yeah, no, but I've uh, a little bit tired tonight. Had a full mm. day. Honestly, I've been like drained all week though. It's been it's been a lot. No idea where to put these things. Oh, whoa, whoa! That's not not the thing I'm trying to click on. Uh, what what are we gonna go first? We're gonna do Kushala or Espinas. Um, I'm equipped for uh, Kushala. So, Kushala. So, so, so the name Espinas. Reminds me of how my aunt says asparagus. Does she say it as aspergas? She no says R. it as aspergas. So yeah, aspergas. Aspergas. Good old aspergas. Don't you know you vegetables keyed aspergas? <laughs> Is that right alongside the uh, ice cream? Ice cream and aspergas. Ice cream and aspergas. <laughs> It's, it's a nice savory uh this sounds like a meal that everybody's gonna be like allergic to <laughs> yeah yeah i think i'm allergic to the concept of it oh there's some sort of avant-garde cook out there who's like i'm gonna turn asparagus into an ice cream and it's going to be delicious and it was not delicious mm. that, that sounds like mad scientist territory yeah, I know a few mad scientist cooks. Uh, yeah, like me. No. Yeah. <laughs> You're just mad. No, I'm not mad about anything. So angry all the time. Guess what? I'm going to be playing Cooking Simulator on the 14th. I'm going to learn about cooking. Cooking Simulator. Yeah. I don't think I know about this. Yeah. It's co it teaches you how to make, I don't know what it is, but it teaches you how to make a food, it's the meal. Is it like goat simulator level simulator? I don't think so. I don't know. Because mm, like Where that, is I'm the fucking monster? I can't find <laughs> it. I I'm pretty sure oh, like, oh, fuck you just, you just went this way. Kushala decided to send a big old tornado and not just one, three, through a cave, which shouldn't be a thing. and. What is attacking Kusha? Oh, Espinas! Espinas showed up. Espinas! What am I on? Oh no, Astalos. Oh, that's Astalos. Astalos. <laughs> oh, I should have grabbed the gold wire bug. Uh, somebody want to grab the gold wire bug while I distract him? Yeah. Uh, yeah, sure, I can go grab. It seems to stay in the water. I have... yeah. We we are running out of time. Yeah. I'm moving. All right. Uh, uh, He's down. Okay. Whoa. I'm, I'm moving. I'm moving. Oh, that was, that was not that close to it. I'm trying to get over there as quick as I can. Okay. I'm just going to go up the mount. It's just go for it. Yeah. I'll get the other one. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I should have done that before I jumped on him, but I was firing guns and. Yeah. That's fine. Understandable. That was the wrong button. I'm terribly sorry. I flubbed that one up real hard. <laughs> no worries. It makes my flood feel less bad, thank you. This is why I'm not allowed to mount anymore. Okay. 
Don't worry. That's my job now. Monster. It kind of is. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, what? No, no, no. What is my question? What? Huh? <laughs> I'm just confused about what what we were really trying to do here today. Kill? Oh god, I was really under a misconception. <laughs> I mean, that's what I'm here to do. Uh oh. Uh, Why? Can you read the description of this quest again? Y you know it's fight or flight, not fight or fuck, right? It could be fight or fuck. <laughs> Sometimes. I <both>. mean. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, if you have a good time, but still. Yeah. Uh, uh, that reminds me, do I have this still in my, like, uh... <laughs> so I was making, um... There was a list that was being constructed uh, today for other reasons. <laughs> for uh -huh. There was a list being made today. Uh huh. And I was casually making my own list, and I was just dropping a bunch of blocks together on a tier list, right? As one does. Uh huh. And sometimes, sometimes you just get a really funny combination. Uh -huh. And it was, it was just like I'm like, yeah, that's a brand. It was literally just like that, and I was just like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Any. Hmm? Context? Oh, I'm po I'm posting images on the stream. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. You'll have to catch that in post, I guess. Oh no, I see it. <laughs> uh huh. What? Okay. Yeah. The tier list makes itself. Sure. Yeah. I mean, who might argue? Where's the monster? <laughs> oh. Up? How'd it go up? It can fly. Wings! Oh. Okay, well. You know, like 90% of monsters in Monster Hunter have. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> These amazing little inventions, they're called wings, that allow them to get mad ups. Mad ups. Mad yeah. Ups. I guess I have booty wings, but they don't seem to let me fly. I am doing my best to figure out where this monster- Oh, it's at the fucking- I was looking at Astelos! I'm like, none of us have found it, so I mean, like, I guess I'm not that behind the curve. And I just realized we're all- y'all fucking fighting it at the bottom of the map. I was trying to figure out how to get to the middle. I'm like, where the hell is Astelos? Jeez, I'm all over the place. I am sorry. Oh, honey. Oh, I have too much honey. Don't worry, I'm- I'm almost here. As soon as I figure out how to climb through this hole. I'm here. How can you have too much honey? You've got a bunch of potions that you need to take care of. I can of. only hold 10 in my bag. Oh, uh oh, no, 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 no. Oh. Fuck off. Oh. Well, I guess I didn't encounter that. Not a scout. One to fuck off, you can turn yourself. I see. I'm talking to Shell, by the way. Of course. No, I, I need you all here. Aww. You're my hunting partner. Aww. I need beat shields. I'm a gunner. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I thought that was coming. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, wait, 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 wait a minute. Yeah. Oh. I'm pumped. I'm gonna eat tomorrow. Oh, which one eat? I food. Yeah. I'm actually taking my dad out for it for the first time. He's never had Thai food before, so I'm hoping he likes it. You see? Yeah, I don't actually care if he likes it. It's, you know, it'd be nice if he did. Nice for I'm that validation of something that you enjoy, somebody else enjoy. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I've never had Thai food. I know, and I'm gonna take you out for Thai food someday. Mm -hmm. Get ready. Get ready for it. Hope you're ready. Yeah, I have been. Yeah, you like spicy food. You like Thai food. Yeah. 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 
Get that yum food in your belly, exactly. Mm. Ooh, that's some tornado action coming my way. Mm. Oh, what? But uh, wow, that did no damage. I don't even think I fell over. <laughs> it just gently like Just a gentle wind went through, like, just blew my hair to the side. That was all the damage I took. <laughs> Kushala seems to have gone to the school of shotgun resistance. Crap, I can't hit it. It's, um, Kushala's nasty in this game. Yeah. Hey, Winter, Typhoon is fucking amazing. It is. Uh, so I'm, really hope I'm hoping he likes it, but. Hello. Like I said, it ultimately doesn't matter to me, but it's like, it'd be nice. We're kind of like on a weird like arc of like, I think he hit the point in his life where he's like, maybe I should have a relationship with my like kids. <laughs> so he's like trying to think and make, I think he's trying to make amends sort of, but not like really that hard. <laughs> mm. It's a weird way to explain it. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, yeah. he's like, yeah, like we should spend time together. But it's only been like once a year, so it's not that bad. I'm like, any more than that would be just like claustrophobic. <laughs> ah, so basically when the guilt kicks in. Yeah, basically. <laughs> oh, lucky life found. Oh, it's all the way outside. I'm comfy in my happy cave home. We got a Kushala here, we got a roof over our heads. What more do we want? Uh, monster fuck. Cause Charlotte Park. Wait, what? <laughs> it's going to kill me. Oh, uh, shit. Um, I'm healing you. That's the life. There you Thank go. You. Ah! Yeah. But no, I'm looking forward to Thai food. No. Yeah. I just got rid of that. Oh, oh. Please. I just want to do damage to this monster. Yeah, if he's being, he's being really like elusive. Or aloof or something, I don't know. That sucks. Oh. I can't counter its wind. Damn. Oh, I can Maybe block we'll that. Monster on rise to... That's cool. <laughs> Monster on rise sunbreak too. The sun breaking. Yeah. Monster on rise sun broke. Sun broke? Yeah, sun broke. The sun's bank balance ran out. What are we gonna do? Don't worry. I think White has this covered. She's been playing this game about like capturing light. It's a really interesting looking puzzle game, but also, <laughs> also, <laughs> explain it, White. Explain it. Okay, everybody. so like, like, th there's this game that um, Dio showed me last night, and it's yeah. about like, it it's basically a um, idle game where you just like build up, you know points and stuff uh, to oh. spend on items to upgrade. You guys know yeah, idle yeah, games. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But anyway, yeah, no, in this one you're having to try capturing, you're trying to capture sunlight. light. Yeah. Yeah, these like sun, sun panels. Yeah. It? yeah, sun panels. Like, it's really interesting because you have like all these little reflections that you have to like bounce yeah. light around to get them to the solar panel because you have to like do it a certain way. Anyway, anyway, so, um, yeah, it's really neat, but um. Anyways, but yeah, no, uh, it's yeah. it's been amusing watching White come up with these devices to capture light all day. <laughs> um, I don't even know how I got on this subject, but anyways, the point is though, she optimized it to the point she kind of invented an inverse light bulb, which is really funny. <laughs> it's a light bulb where the sun is inside the light bulb, and it makes power yeah. from that. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Which honestly, yeah. I think is kind of amazing because it's like kind of destroying the game, seemingly. It's, it's not destroying the game, I don't think. You're, everything's but, like, um, you're optimizing is, everything. Like to- It is like, lagging the game pretty hard. <laughs> I'll post a picture of it like once we have a free moment. It's actually- Okay. Cause like, well, it's like, look at the thing I made. It's amazing. And I'm like, I'm like, oh my God, you just reinvented the, reinvented a light bulb. But apparently <laughs> backwards. Uh, yeah. It's like a light bulb, but then it like 
um, gets converted to uh, infrared, so all this, and then it has to be all this to... white in here is just light being like endlessly bounced around. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, she invented a light. Oh, yeah. he's dead. Right, I, I, I looked away to look at the picture. And I died. <laughs> <laughs> did I just fucking kill you with a light bulb? You did. Damn. You, you killed me with a light bulb. Yeah. Add, add that. To, did anybody have that? Is that bingo for anybody? <laughs> how many? How many? How many light bulbs does it take to put key to the ground? No, no, no. Just it's one. How, many ways, how many ways has code killed me? Yeah. Just one, but the trick is you gotta get key to look directly at it. <laughs> <laughs> there's, yeah, for, my there's, a, die. there's an amazing joke in here somewhere to be workshopped, but that's as far as I'm gonna take it. Oh. I think it just wrote itself. Yeah, it did kind of. Oh, there we go. So yeah, I literally looked away for a second just to see that picture, and I looked back, and it's like I, I was in a corner, the shot was on top of me, and my life was gone. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Yamcha, do you? Yamcha's been Yamcha. Oh. Michelle is perpetually annoying to fight on anything other than range. I think it's pretty annoying to fight across the board, honestly. Yeah. He has your ranged yeah. experience going. If you're not using piercing ammo, which this weapon is not spec'd into. Oh. That's uh, actually, yeah. It's not great, because the shotgun is basically treated as a melee weapon. Oh. It's low, so at least it's almost over. And then we only have an Espinas left to play. Yeah, that's easy. An Take entire one. Espinas. Hey, it's poisoned. This thing's gonna fucking die to poison. Oh my god, I'm gonna be able to shotgun it. Uh, that's a lot of tornadoes. Maybe, yeah. It's only 30 damage per tick. I'm gonna have to get Ooh. some more ammo. Ooh. Oh my god. Thank you for coming back down, Kishala. Yeah, really. Oh my god. Okay, I got it that time. Okay, At least this is just a regular this. one and not like. Yeah, anomaly. Yeah. Alright. Oh, that flash bomb. Oh no, I fucking died before I got there. <laughs> I was so ready to end the fight. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, that's disappointing. Oh, here. I'm going to go ahead and link that game anyway for yeah. a chat. Oh, is it, chat is might it free? Be... Yeah, it's free. Oh, sick. That sounds really no. cool. D d would you like to Would you like me to link you the game to, for you to look at later? Yeah. No, oh, definitely link it to me. I'll have to try okay. it. Yeah. Puzzle game, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Puzzle game about optimizing solar panels or something. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's it's an idle game. It's still an idle game, but um, the idea is that you're trying to um, bounce enough Optimize. light to, yeah, 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 idle puzzle game. Okay, yeah, let's play but... Espinas. Yeah. Okay. Espinas. Yeah. Espinas. Whoa. I ain't waiting. Espinas is in my sights. That's fine. I was right there. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh. Yes, there we go. What part of oh. Espinas is weak to bullets? Holy shit, yeah, I just I went for the wrong part, clearly. Actually, oh wait, he's not angry, so nothing's weak on him yet. Oh. Well, he's angry now. Probably. Now everything's weak on him. The heavy blocks? Well, his weak points become pronounced. Right. I'm gonna put this crab here. Ah! <laughs> what do you think the crab did? I forgot what it would do. You used the blimp crab. You got blimped. <laughs> I did. I thought it would help. Instead, I scared myself can't a little. Me in the sky. Instead, I scared Ow. myself a little. <laughs> yeah, this is a neat monster. Yeah, I like this monster. It's good. Oh, okay, spicy. so, Keen. 
Yes. Um, I've already talked to this about to this decode, but um, so ever since Frontier went offline, um, oh, there's been a huge effort to try and get the game, um, you know, up for private servers. And yeah. what a lot of people are doing now is they're setting up private servers for their own computer and hosting private games with just their friends. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so the word is that the game's mostly functional. Um, okay. all the, all the hunts work just fine, but most of the, like, the extra features and stuff, they, that, that doesn't work. But, like, the basic stuff does, at least. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's, it's, you know, we, we've briefly discussed it, but it's, like, one of those things where it's, like, eh, we got, you know, sunbreak, so it's not, like... You know, yeah, top it would be priority, like, it would but... definitely be older school Monster Hunter, so it's like, yeah. that's something to take into account. Yeah, it, it is running off Monster Hunter, what is it, 2's engine? Yeah. Yeah. Like, that'd be, that's Freedom Unite territory, yeah, so. exactly. So, so that's gonna, kind of the... It's gonna be a step back if you... <laughs> if, if we decide to play it. But right. it does have those Tonfa weapons. It does have those Tonfa weapons. It does have the Tonfas. Um, that right Rainbow. there. <laughs> I know. Is enough. And this monster is there. Oh, that's the flagship monster. Yeah. Uh, he was the original flagship. This is, uh, I believe that the frontier that they're trying to push is like the big one, like the la latest version. So it's he yeah. wouldn't be the flagship there. It'd be whatever. I'm going to die. Oh shit. Uh. Okay. Like powder. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, no problem. That's what I do. Teamwork. Oh, ow, fuck. Oh, okay, I hurt. Ow. I don't know how to get in there from this side. Oh, wait, he's up. Okay, I figured it out. Oh, I'll shit. This guy's weak to ice. I'm using the wrong element. But anyway, we do have a couple of people that are interested in like running servers, but it's one of those, it's again one of those things where it's like everyone's playing Sunbreak or, or other games right now, and it's, yeah. you know, it's just, yeah. Yeah. Not and high priority. Sunbreak's been good. Yeah, Sunbreak's been really good. I'm not gonna lie, honestly, after this longsword, I think I'd have a hard time going back to any other version of longsword. Yeah. You have to <gasps> try a different weapon. Tompa! Yeah, I mean. Well, let's, be, let's be real. Let's be real. Everybody's just gonna play Tonfa. There's no point. There's no point in being like, you know, not saying it outright. We're all gonna play Tonfas and we're gonna have a great time. <laughs> let's see. Um, one of the things that I always thought was funny was that they had made um the kick animation. Yeah. Um, I don't know how it's done. Like yeah. it's like an item, or maybe it's like a charm or something. Or you know, some item that you can get a hold of um, that makes the kicking animation um, viable to hunt mon monsters with. I think it's an ability, if I'm not mistaken. Probably. I don't know if, it's, nice. if Yes. But I remember people would yeah, try and know. hunt monsters all using only that. That was before Tonfus came around. I think all the weapons in some break are the best I've ever been agreed. Yeah. Like, the weapons are just engaging. They're really good. They've done like a amazing job with them. I honestly yeah, it's like. Just, hmm? It's just fun. Yeah, like I'm over the moon about Longsword because it took long. Like Longsword had big problems and they fucking made it interesting, and good. Ow! <laughs> uh. Do you need help? No. What's no. up? Okay. Yeah. Oh. I just want to shoot. Espinas is over here being all Espinas, and I'm trying to be all keen. Espinas is winning for some reason. Broke his face. Yeah. I don't. I don't. Ouch. There's something about uh, same things being all Espinas that's kind of amazing. What? You okay, buddy? Oh, Gina. I think had Gino. Thing. Gina, I think Gina woke up. Woke himself up. Did, are you okay, buddy? Is he okay? I'll yeah, see he's your okay. corpse. Sorry. I know. I know. Yeah. But I know. Yeah, I died right yeah. when I turned to look in. Yeah. 
Hey, hi. Yeah, How you but... doing? We up to? How you feeling? How you feeling? I think my cat had a bad dream. Oh, yeah, I heard that. He's meowing. Bunch. Haha! <laughs> Aspen masses on his ass. His back might also be starting to hurt too. Okay, so. yeah. It's a possibility. We need to give Gino medicine. You just go do it up, okay? He's doing. He's all right right now. Okay. I think he just whatever he was. Yeah, I think it was a bad dream. Yeah. Gino baby, you know. <laughs> yeah. How you feeling? I'm like, I'm like. We have to. We have. Oh, we have multiple babies to be concerned about. <laughs> Ooh, I'm going old school on that one. I had fucking meters to spend. Oh. Oh. Being very vocal. Yeah, he is. He wants oh, my I lap. Every status. That's where this, this is going. There. Okay. Okay. Yeah, he. Whatever it was freaked him out. Oh. Okay, guess I get the ride. Um, I'm like, where do I take it? Uh, there's like some spikes in the walls, right? So I can go down this way. Oh, this is not the right way. Um, okay, I'm just gonna. Oh, I found him. That was not them. <laughs> oh, whoa. you're going too far. This finesse is too fast. Oh shit, you're coming back. Yeah, this, no. this is exactly what this is. Yeah, sorry. And when I realized I wasn't in the right where I thought I was, I just like kind of bailed backwards. I just kind of took him back as much as I could. There we go. Oh, nice. Just took a little detour there. Yeah, well, that's fair. Oh, get over oh. here. Yep. <laughs> I'm coming. So sick, but mostly just exhausted, sore throat. Yep. Oh, gotcha. Hey, Anjanath, you here too? You gonna eat this? Do not let him eat my parts. Yeah. Uh, I think like all the weapons, uh, like one of the exceptions is I miss being able to dive whenever, uh, whenever on the Iceborne Insect Glaive. Uh, it's a fantastic tool for repositioning. It's got some new ways of doing it, so that's good. Okay, so it's not completely gone, it's just mostly different, huh? Yeah. Yeah. See, like, to me, like, Longsword has been kind of bad for a long time, and it's, like, nice to see them actually do something with it to make it, like, work. Um, and I'm not saying it was, like, awful, just that I think that, like, it was entirely, like, based around the idea of, like, landing counters, which is cool, but also, like, like, the DPS of, like, trying to, like, focus on landing counters isn't great. Like, you can't be proactive with that, really. Right. So it's, like, um, it's, like, fine, but not great. Ooh. Uh, two large Elden, Elder Dragon gems and a mantle. Um, but, uh, so, like, seeing them actually give Longsword, like, a cash-out method, a cash-out move, is just, like, oh, a godsend. I think it brings it up to, like, the tiers of, like, Greatsword, Longsword, or, well, Greatsword, uh, Switch Axe, Charge Blade, and uh, Hammer. So, it's nice. I guess, technically, okay. te like, most, most of the weapons have, like, at least, like, a kind of... Uh, banking like payout method. It was just like I felt like long swords just kind of sucked because it was so focused on just countering. That's also just because I didn't like I didn't like playing in that way. Uh, did we rate Espinatus in the flavor tier tier list? I think we did. I think Espinatus is like low in the list. I think it's low in the list, even though it looks like it kind of like maybe like a dragon fruit sort of thing going on, but like. Also, it's all the fire and the poison. Yeah, it seems kind of seems kind of toxic to eat. <laughs> so, I, I yeah. literally got an item called Espinas, uh Toxic Blood. Oh, yeah, that's probably you not got, good. You gotta drain it out before you eat it. Uh, gotta drain out the toxic blood, huh? 
yeah, yeah. Hang it up, let it age for a while, let that acidity, you know, tenderize the meat. Actually, it's like I have to look. Uh, don't join what I posted. Um, okay. I need to see what I can make. What I should be opting to try and make. Um... Oh, yep, that's that's a Kusha it's armor. Like blood. <laughs> blood. Blood. Gotta get that blood. Hmm. Uh, charge blade in blender mode with chain crit is can pretty high. Okay. So... Oh yeah. I've mm -hmm. never for this. Okay. I think I've picked out some of the fight. The keys do I posted. Church play is considered high tier. Um, I have no idea. I'm just hearing it's complicated. Yeah, I, I'm not saying things that are high tier. I'm just saying things that like had like engaging methods of play, mostly. Like, I guess like what I'm trying to get at is like most of the weapons that have like a like payout method for like building up to a like big move and then having a payout. I feel like they were definitely a step above um like like longsword where it was like in the previous game basically you had to like land those counter hits or land the um all the counters and it's like that's not a very proactive way to get your dps so i felt like it was kind of not great like did they do great damage yeah but like church blade had a rep of being op in for you it did it church blade has been good church blade has been good at different points I don't know how it stacks up in this game personally, but yeah, I think the meta charge blade is uh, UAED spam wearing a mixed set of Narwa and Nabushi pieces. That makes sense. Yeah, because like charge blade and like switch axe, like that's the thing is like generally those two things want to go into like their like payout method like as fast and as like intense as they can. So makes sense. Like. Switch Axe was like insane and uh, Iceborne because of it. Uh. Keen? Yes? You've seen Highlander, haven't you? Yes. <laughs> Is that what you're going for? No. <laughs> okay, because that's what you're going for. I'm just, I'm just... I'm going for more of like a Vampire Hunter D kind of look. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. Okay, here, don't don't leave yet. One second. I'm just saying. Oh. Yeah, like uh, ZSD spam. Yeah, ZSD ZSD spam is insane. In Iceborne chainsaw yeah. is still pretty good, but if you want to do that, you got to focus on it. Now, elemental charge blade can hit harder. But yeah, no, it's it's one of those things that's like, I just feel like bringing like longsword into alignment with other weapons uh makes it feel like so much better in this game oh hmm? what come on gino he's like debating on where he wants to it's like do you want in or do you want out you know see as much as i like the other armor and whatnot sometimes i feel like i'm not showing enough chest you know yeah it's important to show lots of chest yeah yeah gotta flex yeah. these monsters out of existence mm. mm-hmm mm-hmm like, you're on Twitch, you gotta show a little bit of chest. <laughs> That's the oh, rule. Yeah. You, you walk up, Barrett's head is bouncing, and you're all good. Yeah. All right, well, White. Yeah? You should oh, ready uh, up. Thank you. <laughs> sorry. Yeah, no worries. Uh, to be honest, uh, I kept forgetting Element because uh, I don't have a focus on to remember to change weapon every hunt. Ah, gotcha. Yeah, sometimes you just find a weapon that's like a okay that you're just like I'm okay with this. Usually, the best option in that case is like a status, a weapon with like a status effect. 
but mm -hmm. yeah. Sleep, like, paralyzed, yeah. good, that good yeah. stuff. Yeah, something like that. Oh, Poison, I guess, is pretty good on this, from what I hear. Yeah, yeah. Elements is super good, good now, and will likely <laughs> get even better after the patch. Mm. Yeah. I've been hearing uh, Camilo's weapons pretty much yeah, out of place. Yeah, Camilo's anyway. is pretty good. Because it's weird because like early on I think everybody was like expecting like status effects to be kind of garbo and I guess they're okay for the most yeah. part like they're pretty good. Just but, like when, when people think status effects in Monster Hunter they think you know paralyzed yeah. and sleep. Yeah. Oh, but shit. the other ones that it's over this way. Whoa, Kizu turns red. Kizu. Kizu forgot his color palette. Like an elemental grace are now with a new combo style. Yeah, the new combo style I hear is like really supportive for Element. But I don't know too much about it, honestly. Oh, I've been, I've been out of playing Great Star in a while. He's a pink. While. Pink, he's it? He's a pink. Ooh, can't jump over that. Yes, I can. Somehow but this is more disturbing. Already stunned? Am I dead? Oh shit! Nope. My powder. He hit me once. Damn. Man, he's who's gonna paralyze the shit out of everybody. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, lovely. <laughs> I don't know what happened there, but it looked really funny on my end. That's Kizu. Yeah, exactly. Just unpleasant. Yeah. That's our Kizu. Look at him go. Kizu has no. routinely been like one of my the banes of my existence. Oh. Damn, that sucks. You're not the only one. Wait, did you like fucking Kizu at one point? No. no that was never mind, that was uh Yeah, Arthur. that was her. Yeah. Arthur nope. for some reason just is like in love with this monster. Oh. Actually yeah, Arthur too. I like think about it. What? Who? Uh, yeah, Arthur as well, now that I think about it. Yeah, who, who did you mention though beforehand? Um, the X. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, that's her Love too. That she, she, she liked, she liked Kizu. Non-stop Kizu fights. Yeah. Oh, Kizu, get back here. I've got wire bugs to throw at you. Yeah, anti prowls this is definitely a good idea for this uh, fight, for sure. Okay, Kizu's decide to leave. Never mind. Yeah. Hmm. Stun Master. Do I have stun? Ma I think I have some kind of stun reduction. Mm -hmm. oh. Stun resistance. Yeah, level three. Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah, as we'll see, you should probably have stun resistance. That's pretty standard. That's it's usually like you wouldn't want to not like. It's a it's a level one gem. Like most people don't have anything better for level one gems to place. I got all kinds of good stuff for level one. But you got it's better than stun resistance. Like defense, free mail. Defense is pretty good, but I don't think defense is better than stun resistance. Oh. I'd take, I'd take stun resistance over defense any day. It's like... Oh. You know what? I mean, I guess I was playing... Oh, wow, I'm getting paralyzed like crazy. Every single hit, paralyzed. Oh, oh big damage. Thanks, cat. You decided to hit me as soon as I woke up. Oh. I appreciate you so much. Yeah. Huh. That worked out kind of nicely. Bait. I don't like how pinky is. Light. It's like a newborn baby, fresh from the womb. No, don't. 
<laughs> yeah, this is fair. Yeah, he don't. No. <laughs> Stop. Users <laughs> are born with their electricity glands intact. Broke it. There we go. I de-pinkened the Kizu. <laughs> As they mature, they become more and more white over time to their gross, veiny flesh. <laughs> Murder baby. Yeah. Oh. F oh, shit. Shit. I couldn't I'm think sorry. of the word sleep. <laughs> I, I, was, I was already in the animation. Red buff, please. Red buff, please. Oh, fuck me. Murder, murder the murder, baby. Mm -hmm. Ow, fuck. Come on. Oh, no. Wasn't the gift I was hoping for. Swing, little kitty, swing! Oh, we got a, we got a flash. Oh, we got a straight skizu. Thank you, cat. You tried. <laughs> He's a wing on no eyes. How are you I supposed know. to block him with no eyes? Mm -hmm. yeah. Is there earplugs in this game? There is. Earplugs is... Yep. I actually think earplugs might be better in this game than like the previous like three Monster Hunter games. Most 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 of them like earplugs became like a quality of life thing rather than like a necessity for fights. It basically was never a necessity, but it was like your place was at one point like really like it was it was something to have and then it stopped being really that important. Yeah, yeah back when yeah. you just gained so much DPS from being able to attack constantly. Cause not, I think it was like yeah. the beginning of world. Yeah, I think it was like yeah. Like honestly, I think it was I think it was before world. I think it was like probably the 3DS games, like the maybe the later ones. I think it was for you. Maybe I don't remember. Because it was about the same time that, like, it was about the same time that the skills start to really, like, you could get a lot of skills on your armor sets instead of just, like, a couple. Yeah. Yeah. Because, like... Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was World. Yeah. Because World is when they completely revamped the system, yeah, so it wasn't really needed to Yeah, or true. You could get your plugs actually pretty cheap in World. That's that's right. Yeah. But so, wasn't there, like, um an item you can get that would... Like was temporary a one -time that was that was in for you. You get temporary your plugs, which was extremely good. Yeah. I don't know where I'm going. Sharpness loss, your plugs, and sharpness regen for the song. Oh, hunting horn, so good. <laughs> yeah, hunting horn. I think it, I need to like get a decent. Well, I mean, I've got a decent hunting horn. I just need to get like. Oh, you there's know. some good lists online if you want to take a look. Yeah, Hunting Horn is a very, very explored weapon in this game. Yeah, like, Hunting Horn usually gets explored really quickly because people want to know, like, what's the best, like, support options they can, uh, yeah. do. Ow! Yeah. Uh, has Hunting Horn always given you plugs? Um, I mean, it varies from Hunting Horn to Hunting Horn, <clears throat> I think. There's always been, like, at least one Hunting Horn that did it. Oh, keep! No. Oh, I'm not okay with that. I picked a fight with you, Diddy. Oh, if I send out, if I do the animation to start sending out my bug to like spend on spend yeah. all my extracts, yeah, and Kizu roars, oh. I lose all my extracts and I don't get the attack. Oh, that fucking sucks. Ooh. Yeah, it's just like when I bank all my meter and then <laughs> Kizu roars and I don't get to spend it. Trying to, trying to like feel this hit out. Oh. No, stop roaring. Roar. Yeah. Depends on the horn game exactly. Yep. But your plugs is a really calm. I th I feel like it's fairly common for hunting horns. Um, oh. I think, I think it's like one of those uh. Things you can pick up from a lot of hunting horns. Yeah. Like a lot of them okay. have have that Fry option. Alright. Let's see what we can do. Yeah. Pretty good damage. Let's 
This thing's gonna have a lot of health though. I get, I uh, keep my files, but recent combo land. Uh, oh, oh shit. I looked away to read, read a message, that's my bad. Dang, might be. That's okay, he's poisoned. Yeah. Yeah, he's broke. Yeah, over here like, paralyzed, there we go. Yeah. So like your plugs are kind of cool. Earplugs are like, I think they're more... Okay, so like, here's the thing I find in uh, Sunbreak. Most of the weapons at this point have like a cash out mechanic. So like, mm -hmm. it becomes really like important to be able to land like a very specific hit. On um, I can't count the times that a monster will roar just as you're going to land said hit. So it becomes a problem. Oh, we get a second chance here. Okay, awesome. All right, I won't fuck it up this time. There we go. Okay. Mozart always looks freaky to me. Kizu? Yeah, it's kind of its thing. Kind of its MO. Yeah. I appreciate it though. I think like it's a classic design, you know. Who was it that was? It's very memorable. Yeah. I think it was Rock. I was uh describing the the how what front uh, Freedom Unite had as your first major monster that you hunt, and it's Kizu. Yeah. <laughs> and you don't have you don't have any real armor to like protect yourself against it. Yeah, it's a, it's a rough time, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> I ended up having to make this yeah. really awful looking set yeah. that was a mix of like bug armor and um, Jin Prey armor. <laughs> oh, the counter, that was fucking sick. Please. Oh. Thousand damage to the face. Nice. Just need that break. Oh, didn't get it. Because it reminds me of Aunt Janice and Kellyn. Yeah, I could see it. The um, what what are they called? The angels. Yeah, were were they like were they like specifically angels, the ones that look like the units? I think they I, are. Yeah. I think they all were. I don't yeah, know, it's been I, a long I, I time. mean, like, yeah, I'm pretty sure they're angels, but I forget if they had a specific name. I feel like they had a specific name. I'm not sure. As uh, one of the non-fans of Neon Genesis Evangelion, I can't really. Yeah. Hey, fair. Yeah. It's been like literally like the last time I watched it was like probably like 1999. So it's been yeah. a long time. I wasn't a huge fan of it at the time, admittedly. Yeah. Well, I'm not, I just wasn't a huge fan. It's like, I think it's good, but it's just like, and I understand why it's like a classic, but it's just like, it's yeah. just not for me. I mean, I'm not going to go talk yeah. shit about it. Because like yeah. I've got nothing against the series, yeah. of course. It yeah. just wasn't... It's a little bit too, a little bit too heavy, heavy stuff for me. Uh, I like the scope, but it's kind of black. Yeah, that's a, that's a good way to put it, I think. Like, as far as, like, the scope goes. Because I can appreciate, like, the, like, um, like, some of the bigger elements going on, but it's, like, where it gets a little bit, um, when it gets really depressing, it gets really depressing. The early, the early phases of, of it, I like because it's, like, kind of just, like, giant monster anime. Ro giant it's giant monster robot fighting anime which is like i'm like that's cool you this is like good i'm about i'm about that but then like it gets it gets so heavy <laughs> so it's just like eh. i just ah. kind of wish that it wasn't it was a little bit clearer mm -hmm. on what it was trying to accomplish okay Shit, I bounced off the tail the last second. Huh. Oh, jeez. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Damn, there's some reach. Ah. You okay there? 
Yeah, oh, I'll, hey. I'll live. I'll live. Loud. Yeah, this thing is like worth having earplugs on. Like, this monster's fucking bitching a lot. Yeah. So it, uh, it was always that a coming of age story. Whining. Oh. There we go. I don't know. Shinji did some sus Shin rebirth. Yeah, I haven't seen the newer movies, so I can't really talk to them, talk about them. Oh. The little bit I have seen, though, the animation looked really nice. Kizu, I'm coming up for you. But that's like, you know. Get down here. Ah! Damn it, the ground. God, I'm really hungry. Kizu, yes, get I down mentioned. here. Oh, uh, older one, where are you? Oh, yeah, right, right. Yeah, that's, that's, that's pretty fucked up. Yeah. Like, I was thinking of the newer one, because they all have, like, names that start with R, don't they, or something? I forget how that works. But, yeah, no, like... And that's the thing, it's like, there's like, big, weird, like, heavy themes in it, but it's kind of like, it's gonna make it, like, not for everybody, despite the fact that it's kind of, like, considered, like, an anime, like, classic that, it ends up on a lot of lists that everybody's, it's like, everybody should see this anime, and it's like, should they? I don't think a lot of, I feel like a lot of people would be, like, not, I don't know, I have a hard time recommending it for everybody. If, yeah. if it was a new anime today, then it would be probably kind of forgotten. Because now we're by in no way, shape, or form a star for choice. Back in the day, yeah. you know, it was a big deal. We got an anime every once in a while. Now we get like yeah. 30, 50. Years yeah, when it comes to like localization, that is a good point. Because like you know, because uh, like back yeah. then, you all only, we really had yeah was you know. Evangelion, Slayers, Cowboy Bebop, Trigun. Yeah. That's oh, pretty much that's it. That's bad. Cool. Dragon Ball Z. Dragon Ball Z, Sailor Moon. Like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and that's like a little bit of like Canadian, like can anime in Canada, like problems too. Because the US was no, a little it, bit more like, a little it, bit more it was, liberal. It was, oh. it was pretty much like that here too. Um, yeah. With the exception of like, they would show some of the one-off, like, the really There's short... There's a lot more one-offs in the U.S., for sure, like, being yeah. shown. Because I know, like, a lot of my anime experience came from, like, my friend basically getting, like, uh, tapes from uh, his cousin that lived in the U.S., and he would just record anime that was on the TV. So it's like... Yeah. I mean, that was actually how I experienced Evangelion. The first time was just a bunch of VHS tapes that were, like, recorded from, I think... It's me. It's me. Oh, yeah. Ooh. I got stunned. Yeah, uh, it's fine. Or not stunned, paralyzed. Yeah, we still have two cards, so... The He's monster's low. Anyway. Yeah, exactly. Now, I got paralyzed, and I saw him rear up. I was like, is that gonna reach me? And then over time, I realized, yeah. <laughs> I realized, <laughs> yeah. For what it's worth, I'm trying to a completely new playstyle. Yeah, nothing wrong with that. With an old weapon. And it's kind of working out. Like I'm getting some decent damage. Probably not as much as I would be if I was playing my old style, but yeah. You know. Um. Yeah. I need my like base economy. Oh my god. But you end up with like more stuff in the U.S. Like I don't know, like Gunsmith Cats and things like that, where it was like not really like big series, but they were basically just not on television up here. I have At never until... heard of Gunsmith Cats. I've literally talked about it. I talk about it nonstop. You talk about Pizza Cats nonstop. No, I talk about I talk about. Okay, okay, okay. I don't talk about Gunsmith Cats nonstop, but like Gunsmith Cats is like. That's like something that was like in the U.S. Like it was aired in the U.S. and like I I got it through VHS tapes. It was never up here. It but, wasn't but like here. Early. It wasn't specifically on your television, White. I'm sure, <laughs> but like I was. Okay. Right. It, believe it or not, was aired in the U.S. at one point. 
Right. It's only like a three episode thing though, right? Right. It didn't... Oh my god. No, no, I yeah, get it's it. Like, it's like um, Outlaw Star, for example, uh, or The Big O, or... Um, uh, I'm trying to think of another one. Uh, Tenshi, <laughs> Tenshi Muro. Um, like, those are like all things that were in the US, like distinctly, but they weren't in Canada. Right. Yeah, so like... Yeah. Tekka Man Blade? Nope, never that seen was it. Pop damage. I know the name. I know of Tekka Man just from uh, Tatsunoko vs. Capcom, though. Yeah. Uh, yeah, Rez. Rez Rezin, yeah, how you doing? I, know about Tekka Man. Yeah. I am still, yeah. still to this day, bitter that the Samurai Pete's cats weren't in Tatsunoko vs. Capcom. Oh, yeah, that's like, that's a big loss. That's a big miss. <laughs> Which actually, I really, I read a breakdown that somebody did on Twitter that talked about um, how Samurai Pizza Cats uh, inspired the aesthetic of Mega Man X. And that was like the most interesting thing I've read in a while because it was just like, <laughs> it took two puzzle pieces that have been in my head for like the longest time and just snapped them together. And my brain just like, it's like, oh my God, it actually makes sense. Huh. Yeah, it's really interesting. I, I, I'll huh. try and find the article for you, Keith, so I can link you to it. Um, it was yeah. Really cool. yeah, like it makes sense when you think about it, because like, think about like how the Samurai Pizza Cats would like dash like everywhere's, like their run, yeah. and think about like what can X do in Mega Man X? He has this like dash, right? Yeah. Yeah. Like, there's all these like little like, th like points that they made, and it's like, oh, this is actually really interesting. I remember Gunsmith Cast, nothing about it, but uh, that I watched it. Yeah, like. And even. Mm -hmm. Even like the shape of the armor. Yeah, the armor is very similar too. Yeah, it, even like if you want to get into it, like X's armor is actually the same color as Speedy's armor. So, Speedy's? I think you mean Guido's. No, no, I mean like oh, X's, mean, X's yeah, yeah, actual yeah, the like ar the powered up armor. Yeah. Oh uh, yeah, I suppose. Yeah. 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 Huh. It, yeah. It's it's really interesting. Yeah. They call them Techno Man in the U.S. Yeah, there was a there was a lot of that like weirdness going on. Uh, it's your picky. Um, a lot of that weirdness going on with uh, with like localization at the time, but I think like Canada started to get into more like kind of one-off stuff, um, uh, like one-off animes, like about the time that Space and Teletoons started to take off in Canada. Um, I mean, they're Canadian channels, I think, but yeah, uh, Teletoon definitely is. I don't know about Space specifically, but I'm pretty sure it's Canadian too. Um, but they, that was like when we started to get a little bit more variety in our anime outside of just like basically what was shown for like kids, essentially. Um, yeah, Space, yeah, Space showed Robotech occasionally, they did. Yeah. Uh, uh, Goss. That was a good pick. I don't know. But it's interesting to think about the way like anime kind of. Existed. Yeah. Now, oh. if you uh, if you're an anime fan, it's better to be in the West. Mm. YTV had uh, was really weird since they had Ghost in the Shell on late at night. Yeah, it, it like Ghost in the Shell aired like kind of like early 2002. Like YTV had like this weird like moment in time where they were like, what if we air like kind of you know, like like uh young adult like shows essentially like during um uh during just late night hours which they did for a while i don't by the by the time they by the time that uh they kind of by the time i guess like they how to put it um after they did that i stopped getting cables shortly after that so i don't know if they still do that or not i assume they stopped doing that it feels like mm. probably a point of like complaint potentially. Mm. Uh, yeah, but anyways, so how's everybody doing? Mm. Mm. I do okay. You're okay? Yeah, it's kind of a sleepy night. And mm. chill. Yeah. I'm still trying to get back on my normal sleeping schedule cycle and I'm still not quite there but I'm doing better yeah speaking of which I've only got a couple hunts left in me yeah that's fair 
I understand. Already running a little late. Yeah. Okay. Well, if you need to call it like early or whatever after this one, that's totally understandable. I'll do uh, this one <sighs> like... and one, maybe two more. Oh, huh? what? It, the, you gotta get in the quest. Oh, sorry. <laughs> no worries. I was, I was doing stuff. Yeah. But no, I remember Teletoon having some really interesting stuff on pretty, pretty okay. late at night. Mm. There's some interesting anime. Mm. I yeah, they kind of. There's this one that was aired on space on several occasions, and I still think about it. Uh, is it? Uh, I rem I think I. Mm. Do you remember anything about it? Um, I'm trying to. Just one sec. I think I. Is it this? I think it's this. Yeah. Um, Rare Gen Z, which is about like a old guy that's in like a like life support bed, that ends up going on like a rampage, and like they have to send in like the fucking military to stop him. And go I go eat. What? Go eat. Oh shit! Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Was it Appleseed? No, no. But I don't know. That one always like stuck with me. I'm like, and I couldn't remember the name of it for the longest time. And then like we were able to find it at some point. Because it was just like so weird compared to anything else that was being aired at the time. There's like a nice like influx of like sci-fi anime in yeah. like that time point or time period, which I feel like is kind of. I like kind of like to see that happen again. <laughs> like it just feels like it's been kind of sorely missing for a while. Yeah. Give me like weird one-off sci-fi stories <laughs> about it. I'm like a I I always liked like the outer limits and stuff like that too. So like I like one-offs. I miss my dog. <laughs> I'm just like running. <laughs> I'll be there someday. I mean, I'm I'm right there with you. I'm like, I don't understand how this. What? <laughs> I I don't have a dog either. Oh, okay. I thought you were like. Oh. I don't even know if I should like. No, I'm just gonna stop here right now. Yeah. It's called Crunchyroll. Kinda said there isn't a Toonami or Saturday morning cartoon block to show it off. Eh. There we go. I'm not sure I follow. Oh my god, I gotta put my hair up after this because it's a million degrees. I gotta, my, I gotta get my hair cut soon. It's so, it's so warm. What is it doing? Is it knocked out? What is going on? I think it's just like a little bit tired. Oh, mood. <laughs> Also, why don't you set up the buddy recon on the counter there? Buddy recon on the counter, what? You know about buddy recons, right? No. What's up to you? You can find the spots, then get like one shot uh, teleports. What? You, you send your, you find spots, and you can register one spot on a map to give yourself one free teleport to that what? location. I didn't know that about that. To give you more options than yeah. just the. Campsites. Okay, there's your answer. I didn't know about them. Sorry, buddy recon on the mountain back there. Well, that doesn't matter too much because I didn't know what buddy recon meant. It's not free, you gotta pay points. Oh. Okay. I mean, the point count is pretty neg negligible. Yeah. Okay. How do you do that? You do it from your. App. Oh, hello. No, you, you set it up in, at the um, 
at the same place you send your buddies off to um, do quests for themselves. What? Oh, that's super weird. <laughs> Probably makes sense because I've I've neglected my like buddy counter like a lot playing Sunbreak. <laughs> okay, I guess I got this one. Who wants Tyrex stuff? Good. <laughs> um, I mean, sure. Usually. I like stuff. I'm probably a couple pieces short of an armor set. Okay, I'm gonna take him to the wall. Um... Oh. oh my god. Uh, no! I needed it to curve harder and it didn't. Yeah. Oh fuck. This brief moment is like pocketing. Yeah. My sheath down. Ooh. Yeah. We go find the spot where she said the buddy counter. Okay. I'll have to take a look at it sometime. I had no idea about this. Is it was it in like is this new to Sunbreak or is it? Yeah, it's new. Okay, I was about to say, okay, that makes a lot more sense because I've definitely neglected my buddy system a lot. Yeah. I've just mostly been focusing on killing. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's like, just focused on being an agent of death. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, hey Spawn, how you doing? What are you up to? Enjoying your stream? Yeah, yeah, it's going good so far. A little bit, a little bit like lazy tonight, but that's okay. It's been, it's been like honestly a super like emotional week for me. So like I'm, I'm definitely running a little bit on the tired side. I know even tonight's stream is probably gonna end up being short. And tomorrow's might even be short too. Mm -hmm. oh. You dropped me. Week. What? What? Get, get to the ball. Uh, oh. Oh, it says short good. stream what? It says short stream wink. Oh, wink. And then you're like, short stream, wink, wink. And I'm like, wait, what's happening after the stream? <laughs> I mean, maybe? <laughs> yeah. All right. Oh, that was actually shorter than I thought it would be. Oh, but never mind. Those are seashells. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just like, I'm gonna collect some seashells now. I'm an agent. I'm an agent of death. But that doesn't mean I don't like pretty colors. Okay. Ooh. That's one way to waste a meter. Oh! Oh! Wow! Oh! Woo! That's smart. Ooh, I was—I don't know if I had how much damage I had in there or what, but that—that that definitely. Ow! That hurt. Uh, is that one shot? Damn. Uh, sorry, I keep signaling because I'm trying to remember my buttons. It's been like. No Last time I played this was probably not last week, but the week before it was probably Thursday. So it's been slightly less than two weeks. Hey, no worries. Yeah. But I wanted to get something because I know that like 
Some breaks, some breaks good, and I'm enjoying it. It's good. It's we haven't played in a little bit, yeah. and... and it's nice to have something different like this to like chew on, especially yeah. since I've been like chewing out a lot of like single player games for the last like while. So it's always a treat to be able to like play something like a oh, life burp. round. Burp. Burp. Where is it? It's a burp. Got it. Nice. Good one. Teamwork. Teamwork. I just sent my bug into the stratosphere. <laughs> send that bug oh, to the moon. Bug. You are now a space There's a rocket ship. Put the bug in it. The bug is the rocket ship. Oh. Oh, there we go. Hey, triple sevens. Jackpot. Nice. Yeah. Jackpot time. Yeah. We just need that last break. Come on. Ah, fuck. Oh. Wow, that did like no damage. Uh, I guess I took a blade tip off it. Oh, oh. Ow. It's those spinning orbs after this. I know, yeah. right? <laughs> Every time. Shit. That was unfortunate. Yeah. But no. I think I get back into watching anime on the regular though. Cause I feel like I'm I feel like I'm like I'm not in like all my discussions related to anime are basically anime from like 20 and 30 years ago, which is no good. Yeah, yeah. I mean anime lately has been very, very disposable. Yeah. That's fair. Every once in a while a really good series comes up, but yeah. I've been still been watching a fair amount, I've just not been doing anything yeah. really gotcha. outside of it. Just watching and forgetting. Yeah. I need to finish up the ones that I started watching. Yeah. Uh, Spy Family is very good. Yeah, Spy Family looks really good. Everything I've seen online for it is just like, oh, this looks really like really sweet. Like if you want an anime to encourage people to have like, you know, families, this is probably the way to do it actually. <laughs> Versus, it's I don't know, good. like... Hmm? It's just not what I thought it was going to be. Oh, really? Oh, Because it looks, it looks, uh, looks wholesome. Yeah, it, it's pretty wholesome, but I expected, like, a little bit more... Spy, spy? in my spy okay. family. Yeah, okay. Yeah. My only they recommendation... Hmm? Best daughter reaction face in the series. Yes. It's very cute, and everyone is so fucking dumb. Oh, well, that's great. So, like, that's the thing, is sometimes you need, like, an anime that's just kind of light. Especially, like, right now, because, like, things things are rough. So it's nice to have something yeah. light and cute and fun and dumb. Oh, like me. Yeah. Oh, it didn't roll anything. I'll, I'll activate the roller in just a moment. After I end this fight. Oh, beautiful. Your life's gonna end in 30 seconds. There we go. Oh. <laughs> Pardon me. Hey Charles, how you doing? Yeah. Uh, also, hey Queen. Oh my goodness. Thank you for the thank you for the bits, Queen. Yeah. Uh, how are you doing? How's things been? Yeah. Uh, Charles, what are you up to? What have you been doing? What have you been playing? Mostly 14? Oh. There we go. Oh. Getting back into Halo. Oh, hey, that's interesting. Yeah, hey, Belle. How you doing? How's this been? Yeah. I'm doing good. I'm like, did we get raided? Like, there's a lot of people all, all popping in at once. I should probably focus on punching this monster. Wait, what? You know what? Fuck it. Oh my god, I missed. Huh? Okay, well, oh. there we go. I fixed it. I disconnected. Oh, shit. Okay, well, it's almost over, right? Wait, it was asleep? Mm. Wait, it didn't even... What did I hit? How did it... How, what? What is going on? Mm. 
Ugh. Oh. That sucks about the disconnect. It's okay, I'm enjoying a day off and surviving the summer heat. Hey, fair, fair. Yeah. Aw, oh, thank you again, Queen. Thank you. Yeah. Will you enjoy your day off? I appreciate you swinging by. I always appreciate those bits. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Ooh, I'm breaking parts off of them. How's, how's Halo Infinite? I've heard I've heard good things. I'm doing good. Uh, I'm just just waiting for my midnight uh, time, so I'm allowed to use my walk. My partner got for me for my birthday. Oh, very good. Oh. Who oh. was it we were talking? I forget who I was talking to the other day, but they were talking about like they were wishing that they had a walk. Oh. Uh, birthday, but I said I couldn't unpack it until uh, my birthday, and now I'm just like watching the clock. Oh, is your birthday tomorrow? Oh my god, Bell. Yeah, I will roll. The, I will re-roll that hat. You'll have, just have to bear with me, just because we're in the middle of a hunt. In fact, I have a moment right here, so maybe I can do it. Oh. Oh, Nothing oh. again. Beautiful. I will have to see what I can do. Only to all flash him, so it'll. Um, nope. So you don't have to flash him, so I can roll a hat. It's okay. Why not? There we go. I gotta fix my roller. Oh, detective hat. There we go. Um. Oh. Yeah. That's okay. We're still in it. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Incidentally, it's right there. Perfect. Detective mode engaged. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm gonna solve the mystery of who killed White. It's not a mystery. It's a mystery. Who did it? Who could have no, been? No, it's not. Yeah, it's, if only we had a way to figure out who killed White. It's literally the giant Yeti. But how, what evidence do we have, White? We have to. We have to. We have to have evidence before we can make such an accusation. We have like twenty witnesses. Would you all would you all go to court and like back white <laughs> up on this? <laughs> Twenty people in the stand. Oh. It was Keed. I saw the whole thing. <gasps> Keed. And you know what? what? He went. He disconnected shortly after White died, or shortly before White died. So we, yeah, yeah. I left before. That's my alibi. Oh. Okay, maybe it wasn't Keed then. But that would be the perfect alibi, so we can't rule Keto out just yet. <laughs> what? It's a two. It, the alibi is too perfect. That's fishy. Oh. Look at Herlock Shlom's hair. Uh, <laughs> it was keyed. I saw the whole thing. We got two people. It's, uh, no, never mind. But like an uh, hour and a half. Uh, take out season it. I'm so excited. Oh. Too convenient. See, right? Uh, that's what I'm saying. Seems kind of sus. Now, as far as anime goes, though, um, the only thing I'm probably for sure watching coming up is probably uh, Chainsaw Man, because I read Chainsaw Man and I liked it. So, have you have you read Chainsaw Man, Keith? I have. You have. Gotcha. You gotta watch the anime. Awesome. Yeah, I feel like I feel like the anime might end up being a lot better than the manga in some places, just because it's it's visually um <laughs> kind of messy at different points in the in yeah. the manga. Yeah. So I'm interested to see where it goes. I know one anime that we should probably watch. Oh. Um, it's the new uh, Triton. Oh yeah, well that's a no-brainer. That's definitely gonna happen. <laughs> yeah. Which I kind of feel doesn't really um, solve the problem of us talking about anime from like 20 and 30 years ago. Yeah, but... really. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but. Yeah. Actually, I don't think I've ever like picked your brain on that, Keith. What do you think of the new Trigon anime? I'm definitely curious. Yeah. 
but uh, uh deep drop? I'm uh, not on. Really? Really? I don't know. I feel like. Here's here's my point. I think the studio can fucking blow it out of the water because I think the studio that's working on it is really good. I think it's They've entire themselves in yeah. That is um, it's entirely gonna be based on the writing. If the writing yeah. is good, it'll be good. If the writing isn't good, it's gonna be rough probably. Yeah, yeah I don't know. Because yeah. the studio that did it is doing uh, was the same studio that did Land of the Lustrous and. I, I think they visually know what they're doing. And be like, the thing. It's it's not the visuals that I'm worried about. Yeah, and see that's what I'm saying. Is if it, if it fails, it's not going to be because of the studio's visuals. Cause it's going to be a very nice looking show. I think, I think it's interesting because I'm, I get this impression they're either going to make it like before Trigun, so kind of as a like middle ground between the early events of Trigun and then like when Trigun actually takes place. So kind of, you know. Like, like oh. one of my biggest oh. fears is that yeah. they're just not going to get the goofy side of Vash down. I do think it might end up being like way more emotionally like uh, driven, which I think is a realistic possibility. But I think that like that's the thing is like, like I think it's important to like that's an important aspect of Trigon is the fact that it's a very like emotionally intense like you know. Yeah, uh, it's that's emotionally very, intense. It, yeah, still it, manages to like keep like a sad stilliness to it. Yeah, like, and that's the thing is like, I feel like, I feel like there's people out there that are definitely gonna be like, oh, it's not Trigun because it's not goofy, and it's like, but that was never like the point of Trigun. But, no, it, yeah. it's not the, the yeah. goofiness. Like, I know that that's not the point you're making, like obviously. It. But like, that, yeah. There was a certain duality of Ash, and like yeah. that's what made his character work because he was yeah. a tragic character. Yeah. yeah. And like he was silly because of that trauma. Yeah. Oh yeah. Definitely. That's just kind of how he lived with it. Yeah. Goss is tough. Yeah, I know. Goss is taking us a while too. It would help if I actually hit him with my sword, I suppose. But I mean, I'm. I don't want to no. get too like oh oh fuck, jeez, uh, heals. Oh. Okay. Okay. I saw you fly up in the air and then you tried to fucking cleave you out of the air. I was. Yeah, I know. I was a little nervous. I'm not gonna lie. There we go. Oh, I too was nervous. <laughs> it looked a little rough. Look, the monsters have too much HP. They do. It's a lot of HP. My um, my where my controllers are saying it's low on battery. If you need to bail to the camp, you just bail to the camp. I'll finish the fight. Aww, it just should be fine. Okay. But I know which one it is. Okay. It's the one that's been giving me trouble. Okay. Oh, there we go. I kind of forgot this monster was afflicted, actually. Ah. Oh. This thing just die already? <laughs> it's not even low. New anime, uh, you can try the silly, uh, Kongming anime? Question mark? Haven't heard of it. Yeah, boy, Kongming? Uh -huh. That's my big problem, too, though, is I'm, I'm really not, like, on the up and up. I haven't, like, been. Usually, like, I at least, like, look through each, like, new season for anything that, like, pops or, like, stands out, so I kind of at least have, like, passing familiarity with, like, whoa, that's gonna help. Pop him. Yeah. Huh? Do it. There. <laughs> at least I have passing familiarity, but I haven't done that over the last year or two. Oh, it's okay. not, it's not even, like, a byproduct of, like, oh, well, I, you know. I, s I think lots of like new shows are still really good. It's just, uh, just I haven't been like active, I guess. I haven't had the time. Kidnader, yes. Yeah, it's a little bit of having having the um ah. uh, having the time. Ooh. Okay. Having the time, because like stream life is like very hour intensive. Yeah. Yeah. Time I should be coping with uh, humor is the most relatable anime character. Absolutely. Like. And that's that's the thing. It's like Bash. Bash is like, oh, Bash is like, very very human in that way. 
Like, yeah. it's, a, it's, it's one of those things that that's kind of one of the things that was always really stand out about Trigun. Uh, Trigun uh, in that particular time period. It's silly, but the core is sincere. <laughs> exactly, Vento, exactly. And that's like super important. And I think like, even if the humor is like a little bit like less there than like Trigun Trigun, I think as long as it's like sincere, I think I'll still probably really enjoy it. Because there's probably gonna be like a lot more like heavy emotional beats seemingly. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. I'm just over here like I miss when we had keyed. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm like even if he was White's killer, I kind of miss him. See how he it was is. doing good damage. <laughs> oh, I see how it is. <laughs> what? It's low. Okay. He better be. It was Bash, uh, Spec from Cowboy Bebop, and a few others that molded me as a teen. Absolutely. Yeah, growing up in that era, it was like, you know, there wasn't as many shows, of course, which is also a factor, but it's like, they're they're very, like, they're very, like, uh, the solid characters sort of have a lot of relatable qualities about them. You want to capture it or kill it? Can't you cap. Can't. Oh, we, we can't yeah. cap, can we? No. I know. And we got to finish the uh, fight. Oh, okay. This quality over quantity, exactly. And that's the thing is when you had less, when there was less series like kicking around, they had to, you know, be a little bit more particular. But I mean, there was also a lot of trash at the time too. Like that is also definitely a thing. Oh God. But yeah. we just, we just don't remember the trash, right? Like we, like we do the really good ones. That's why it's always like easy when you look back at like games and anime and things like that that say like, oh, it was all amazing back then. But no, there's still a lot of garbage. That said, like, the pure amount of things that come out now does make it, like, you know, harder to compare, I guess, in that way, too. Oh, nice one. Yeah, I'm gonna die. Oh, shit. Uh, like powder. Okay, it went for me. Snail, though. Snail. Snail. Oh. Get some, get some violence going on. Uh oh. Oh, the counter. It was worth a meter just to stay in it. Sometimes, sometimes, and that's the thing, it's like, even though, even though, like, Longsword now has a bank out move, there still is, like, the emphasis on, like, you can maintain flow instead. Just be untouchable. Or get punched, it's cool, whatever. Whatever floats your boat, yeah. really. The ratio of good to bad anime was even, uh, was more even back then. That's true. Yeah, the same could be said to both games, too. So. Because you just have, like, less studios doing less. And nowadays, you just have, like, a million games coming out a day. So there's always that <laughs> factor. There we go. Yes. Yes. Oh. Oh. There we go. Gonna perk. Ow! Uh oh, uh oh. I've I've overcommitted! I have regrets, White, you might have to save me. <laughs> Thank you. I'm good. I overcommitted. I had the bloodlust. The worst status effect. Oh. Oh, oh. Hey, yeah. there we go. Ooh, it was a ride. Ah, oh, 
Perfect timing on that cheese. I'll just tuck <laughs> it under my hat. <laughs> yes. uh, instead of uh, instead of my life is time, I got reincarnated into a video game. The anime based on the manga based on the game. Oh, got a beast gem. Get a purple mouth. Oh, um, grape. <laughs> yeah, I may have to bow bounce Got out it. simply because that fight took too long. Uh, yeah, your battery life. My battery, yeah. Yeah, I suppose you're yeah. getting pretty late, keyed, aren't you? Oh, it's it's way past my bedtime. Yeah, you got to get this. What are you doing, staying up? Who said you could stay up? Well, we didn't start till nine thirty. Oh yeah, that's my bad. <laughs> yeah. Well, you said you were, we were doing it at nine thirty. I said I said nine, and I was a little bit late, admittedly. So Keith's got me on that one. But I'm always a little bit late. But I'm trying to do Hello. better. Hello. Uh, Bakari, how you doing? I had to call out the it's guy genre for just a second. I apologize. Yeah, it's guys are like, it's such a weird thing to me because like. I feel like there's so many Itzekai stories that could be told without them being Itzekais that could just chop off the front bit and you'd have like a interesting story that doesn't have to be an Itzekai for no real reason. Just so saturated it is. And it's the weirdest thing, I can't really put a... Like, I can't really pinpoint why either. Like, why did Itzekai suddenly like take off to such a high degree? Sword Art Online. I don't know. Oh, yeah. <laughs> maybe, maybe it's just like... Sword, Sword Art Online did it. But I mean, like, at the same time, though, you know what I mean? Like, there's still... Um, it wasn't even the first one. I don't know it, why it... Like, why you, they... I mean, like, on a more broad sense, not, not like... You know what I mean? Like, maybe there's, like, a through line where it's, like, MMO culture or, like, video games have encouraged this kind of, like, storytelling. You know what I mean? No, okay, just me. <laughs> because they can be used, uh, they can be used as lame power fantasies for weird nerds. Actually, yeah, that's also definitely a factor. Yeah. Yeah. I miss Die Hack. Die Hack is a weird one. I never get super invested in it. Ow! I just punched myself on the side of the head. I don't know if you all heard that, but it hurt. No, I didn't okay. hear that. Okay, good. My sound canceling is working. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> I was trying to reach back and like brush out my hair a little bit so I can put it in a ponytail. Shit, where did I put my hairband? I have no idea where it is. Uh, ow. I heard the clock. Okay, that was me. <laughs> that was me punching the side of my headset. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, I don't know. Lots of Itzikais are from mm. light novels, so they're making an anime to a fan base there that's already there. Hmm. Yeah, the, the whole like, but it's also like, why did the, why is there so many, uh, I heard your brain swag as your skull. No, you didn't. It definitely didn't <laughs> happen. <laughs> that is not a thing that happened, probably. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so, <laughs> you sound really tired, White. Oh, I'm fine. Just kind of, <sighs> I can relax now. <laughs> I'm just gonna go down here for a second and move some stuff around since it sounds like we're probably wrapped up on Monster Hunter. Mm. Well, if we do some tomorrow, I'll try and be early. Er. Yeah. And I'll make <laughs> sure the controllers are charged yeah. this time. Yeah. Jeez. Uh, been uh, playing seriously, uh, Serious Sir Sam? Oh. Keith, you like Serious Sam, don't you? I do like Serious Sam. Yeah. There's, a, there's like a newer one that came out that's like a roguelite, isn't there? Like, it was... I don't know if you played it. Uh, Serious Sam has literally been every type of game ever by now. Yeah. But, like, mm, recently. Interesting. In fact, The Witcher has Itzakai elements. Oh. Well... Hmm. I mean, there was a crossover with Monster Hunter. Honestly, a uh, really good Itzakai that barely... An Itzakai was Grimoire of Fantasy and Ash. And they dressed the characters... Kids from our world first scene and never address it again. 
I think that's like the best way like for Etsukai's is when they just like they use it as just like the springboard to get the story started and then they just never touch on it again. Just like don't go back there. There's like, been a couple Isekai's that I've enjoyed where the issues that the main character had in his original or their um, original world yeah. do come through. Yeah. Like they, they didn't forget the that it wasn't Isekai. Yeah. You yeah. know, just constantly being like, it's a game. This is a game. The original Isekai is Digimon. Uh, yes, I actually, you know what? Digimon's like Digimon's like maybe the one example of an Isekai that I really like that actually does like just like it's an Isekai the whole way through. They make point of trying to always get back to their home, you know, get back to the world and get to the digital world or whatever. And at least in the first season or two and then like it becomes more like world earth focused i guess mm -hmm. but like i always i like digimon digimon was always fun yeah 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 it reminds me i saw a map recently that is apparently from uh the anime brazil doesn't exist in the world of digimon and i don't know why huh the whole map is identical to like Earth and just except without Brazil. <laughs> That's interesting. Yeah. Yeah. Interesting. Mm -hmm. What happened? I don't know. I think it might still be on my desktop because I saw it. I'm like, I got to take a closer look at that. <laughs> Let me see. Can I find it? Anyway, I really gotta you get gotta, going. Yeah, take <laughs> off. All right, Keith. Thanks for joining yeah. me. Yeah. Thanks for your yeah. hunting. Yeah. And do you have a good night? Um, I'll hit you up tomorrow. Tomorrow later. Bye. 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 What's up, Wyatt? I'm, I'm charging my batteries. Okay. <laughs> That's fair. I really need to make, power make power sure control. make sure to charge them this time for reals. But the thing was, they were charged. They've been sitting in the dock for like days. Like, there's no reason why they shouldn't be charged. I don't know what to tell you. It's just it it happens sometimes. It'll just yeah. be like oh, they net charged, and then like. 10 minutes later, they're like fully charged. It's like, assholes. You're just being dramatic, stupid controller. You over dramatic battery. Your batteries are overly dramatic. Yeah. Wow. I can't say I've ever had that problem, but it's. it's I've funny. I've had them pretty much. I've had this problem pretty much since like I got them. So Fair. it's like this is just how they are. Yeah. All right. Okay, I'm gonna switch my phone over here. Oh, it's scalding hot. Ah, ah, it hurts. It burns. You okay, babe? Yeah, it's really, really warm. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Um. And oh, I have a weird issue for some reason. But. Never mind, I guess my software is just gonna crash. Cool. I can't believe your batteries have fibromyalgia. <laughs> oh my gosh. Can't believe it, White. <laughs> okay, we're gonna turn that off. Um, I'm gonna be back in just two seconds. Just wait. Just wait for me. I'll be back. Oh, I'm having a weird issue. Oh, there we go. I fixed it. Yeah. Yeah. And... Oh. There we go. Okay. There we go. That's better. Oh, I'm like frozen. What's going on here? What? I'll say what? Why am I Mine frozen? Mine says I went out to take out the garbage stand and the garbage bins were covered in hornets. Oh. Yeah, that's not fun. No, that's not good. Okay, let's like exit this and see what's going on. Just one sec. I might be having like some tracking issues. Yeah. yeah it makes things difficult, doesn't it? Okay. Okay. So load it in. Yeah. 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 I made it. Okay. All right, um, let's get a little bit of sound mm -hmm. going here. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. 
Bento says new isekai are an exploration of what you would do with a second life or a second chance at life. True. Problem with a lot of, uh, problem is a lot of people use it as an excuse to explore power, power fantasies. fantasies. Yeah. And in a country where public displays of affection and sexuality are frowned upon, like Japan, power fantasies with harems are super popular there. Yeah. Yeah. Which is like... There was a whole generation of anime that was harem anime too, so it's like, yeah. Yeah, like, I was about to say, you don't need an is Itsukai to have a, a power fantasy with harems. Like, let's get Tenchi Muyo. <laughs> but honestly, <laughs> honestly, I will say, like... In Itsukai, where the main character who is going to have a harem getting hit by a truck in the opening is probably slightly better than a harem anime where they don't get hit by a truck in the opening. That's fair. <laughs> I mean, maybe. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I can't uh, like, there was a recent news about how some schools banned having ponytail hair cells because showing their nape was considered too sexy. Nape? Like the back of your neck? Yeah. Oh. I wonder if I have a sexy back on my neck. Mm, probably you to, not. You have to. We'll, have yeah. to we'll have to talk about that later. Yeah. Okay. I'm like, you gotta, you gotta give it to me. You gotta give it to me straight white. <laughs> Is the back of my neck sexy enough? <laughs> I'm like, yeah. Uh, it's funny uh, that we're at a point where you're getting hit by a truck and being transported to another world where people want to fuck you. Is the easiest way to get laid. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Seems about right. Uh, hmm. Oh gosh. Okay, so um, the plan is. I'm like, what was I actually scheduled to play today? I didn't even look. I'm not gonna lie. I just knew Monster Hunter was the first thing on the list. Um. Oh, I actually, I, I, I didn't even look, but I got it right. So I'm gonna be playing multiverses next. But I think I don't know if my dailies have recycled to multiverses, so I'm gonna have to give that a second. Nape of uh, the neck is considered sexy in a lot of Asian countries. Cultural differences, I guess. Uh, that's fair. I mean, and like, how to put it? Um, it's a sensitive spot, so like, there is like that, but like, just to like look at it is like, I don't know if it would do a lot. Mm, some people do have sexy necks. It's actually true, but mm, I don't know. I'd have to think about that a little bit more. Yeah, it is a fairly sensitive spot. People often, like, forget about it when they're, um, doing, um, things that involve touching other <laughs> bodies. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Because, like, no, the back of the neck is very good. It's very sensitive. It's, it's sensitive in a very, like, kind of, like, um... It's usually not overwhelmingly sensitive, but it's just like pleasant. It's like it's like a pat territory. Yeah, my brain is trying to figure out uh, what a name job would be. <laughs> I can picture it. <laughs> and all I'm here, all I'm doing is sitting here thinking, maybe we're maybe we haven't considered the, how uh, the concentration of vampires are at. You know, yeah. maybe they're in the Asian countries. <laughs> yeah. Like, okay, okay, hear me out. A nape job. Um, oh, no. It, Go it, ahead. <laughs> okay, if you can picture like two like saw horses <laughs> and a person like laying between them, and then, okay, I'll draw a diagram. Just, <laughs> sorry, clearly it was too complicated right out of the gates. <laughs> someone laying between two sawhorses and then you just like it depends what what parts you're working with but like you can really go two directions but it's mostly a sawing motion you're basically trying to saw fuck <laughs> fuck this is just not going anywhere as good there's nothing this is like the least sexiest activity that's ever existed <laughs> I'm going to go find my controller. I'll be right back. I need food. Why? You gonna have... Uh, let me... Let me see if I... Let me see if multiverses is like... Uh, rolled over or if I'm gonna have to like squeeze something in between. We did... I did my daily name job is the opposite of a neck job. Uh, <laughs> just... Just sawn at the back of their neck with whatever you got. 
Hmm. What, that does nothing for you, White? No, I'm, I'm trying to process it. Yeah, I, I don't recommend it. <laughs> don't, don't process, don't... Okay. Don't perceive. Okay. Back of the neck is very nice. Yeah, no, that's what I was just saying. Winter was the back of the neck is really nice. It's like people people that know how to like work the back of the neck. Mm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh, yep. The rollover has happened. So, uh, are you gonna join me for multiverses for a few rounds? Yeah, we can play. We can play okay. a little bit. Okay, but I'm gonna have to like um, go find my controller because it's not at my desk because my mom stole it for playing to play Elden Ring. She's currently at the, um, I don't know, that I forget what the name of it. Would she sneak into your room uh, and take it? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> no, she will. Like, we only have one controller okay. th between between us, so it's like... Oh my god, do you, baby, do you need a controller? No, like, I'm gonna, like, it just hasn't happened. It just hasn't happened. And the thing is, is like, I have to recharge my controller. Yeah, I have to recharge my controller, like, all the time. Yeah, mm -hmm. cor corset, well... Corset, welcome. How you doing? Wear your pants. I'm I'm wearing a skirt. Yeah. I'm like, I don't know how visible it is. Nope. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm like, here. Um I don't know if this will work. I think it'll work. I'll just step back from the camera. Nope, it's gonna be a problem right now. There we go. Mm -hmm. There we go. There. Oh, there, see my skirt. Yeah. Just so have to step farther and farther back. There we go. Yeah. I'm just really <laughs> tiny on this couch, apparently. Yeah, I was about to say that this couch, yeah. the, this couch is much bigger than I thought it'd be. Yeah. I'm usually just sitting in front of the couch, so I'm not actually on it. it it's, this the actual size is actually quite intimidating. For <laughs> once I woke up uh, and my mom was literally sitting in my room playing Dragon Quest VIII. She apparently been there for hours. Oh, well, that's really nice. I see now. Strap's attached to it, too. Yes. Uh, I had my mom wake me up at 5 in the morning just so she can watch me play Final Fantasy XII. Uh, She's like, hey, get up. We need to play 12. And it's like, what? Yeah, I need to see where things are going. It's like, ah. Uh. She's like, I'll make yeah. pancakes, but you turn the game <gasps> on. We're going we're gonna to figure out how to we're gonna continue. Oh, it's like, oh, that's very good, okay. actually. I want pancakes. Yeah. Anyways, welcome to the stream, LaBelle. Yeah. Uh, I've got a story about pancakes. Oh, tell me about your story about pancakes. I need to know more. So, so one time I was at my mom's. I okay. think I've told you this story. Maybe I don't know. I, I enjoy ta talking about this story okay. because, like, my uh, my half brother, mm -hmm. he was like, "Oh, I want pancakes," and my mom like had these little the pre pre um, portioned right. little pancake things. Yeah. And she's like, "Okay, I'll make you one." And she's like, hey, do you want one too? And I was like, oh, sure. Anyway, so she makes his first and he like runs to the bedroom to eat it while watching TV or whatever. And anyway, uh, she made me mine. And just because I can, I put like chocolate syrup on them. Yeah. <laughs> and like I, right when I did that, he like comes in there with his empty plate and he's like looking at my plate. And he's like chocolate syrup on pancakes like why not it's just syrup he's like staring at it <laughs> it's like it's like the heavens opened up as a new avenue of of glory has, has appeared before him and he's like mom can i have some more pancakes <laughs> thank god <laughs> she's like no <laughs> nobody educated that kid man yeah, no <laughs> i mean chocolate syrup's actually pretty common like pancake topping yeah no. Uh, no? Uh, really? Not, not one as of much my, as One I of my first dates with one of my partners, I went to, we went out for breakfast and I got a stack of like chocolate covered pancakes. They're amazing. That's like fancy, that's like fancy stuff. Yeah, I know. It, it took me to a fancy it's, slice for breakfast. <laughs> you know? It's not, it's not that common to have chocolate um, syrup on pancakes though. Um, really? I wouldn't okay. object to it though. Okay. I thought it was fairly common, but I mean, I guess what do I know? Yeah. Ara ara. Yeah. I'm the only person that's ever put chocolate pancake or chocolate syrup on the pancakes that I know of. Oh. Apart from me, apart from your excursion. Yeah. To be fair, the pancakes were also chocolate, so it was actually just like eating a basically a chocolate cake for breakfast. Yeah. Yeah. He he basically yeah. he he was like, you can't fucking finish that, and I was like, try me. <laughs> I almost fucking died. 
Yeah, I was about to say, you didn't finish there's, that. There's a, there was a photo of me. I can't put it on stream because it has my uh, fleshy meat body and... But I'm basically sitting there at opposite of Dio. <laughs> like, with the most, like, concentrated, like, disappointment on my face about the fact that I couldn't finish the last bite of chocolate pancakes. Yeah. <laughs> Over chocolate syrup on pancakes. Time for pancake syrup on chocolate. Oh, God. That would be so, like, gummy. Getting a banana sundae when I get paid. Oh, hell yeah. Do it. Oh, banana sundae. A single pancake. See, like, what we do in my family for pancakes is we make, like, really, really small pancakes. Do you know why? Oh, why? Take a guess. It's genius. I came up with this when I was, like, four. Um, so you could pick... So you can, like, eat them like chips? No. 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 It's genius. When they're smaller, you get more edge. Oh. Yeah. yeah so, and I fair. like the edge of the pancakes, like, the most, because it's kind of just a little bit crispy. It's like the smaller yeah. you make them, you can just make a whole bunch. I used, because, I mean, I was like baby basically, and so uh, mm -hmm. most of my, I was like three or four. So like I played Super Mario Brothers, right? So I used to call mm -hmm. them coins. And that's basically yeah, that's stuck in my family, like basically forever. So so yeah. apparently my mom used to do that. When she was mom. little, she'd request small uh, yeah. pancakes like yeah, that. Yeah, that's where it's but, at. Um, they always called them uh, silver dollar pancakes oh, that makes sense that works i've heard of that before but that was like way after i was like four. yeah 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 but the, they always tower called defense them. pancake tower defense <laughs> game i'd play mm -hmm. that i can kind of picture what it would be like It'd be like a restaurant game <sighs> mm, yeah i'm gonna have to go find my controller right quick and also brush my hair out so okay yeah because it's pretty messy so um if you don't okay. Um, you also can take a break for a minute, so we're just gonna take like I'm gonna say we'll just take a 10 minute break and we'll be back in a few. How about that? Sure. Okay, yeah. that sound good to everybody? Yeah. Alright, okay, I'll see y'all in 10 minutes, get some water, get some food, and uh, we'll be right back with probably multiverses. Get yeah. some cakes or pancakes if you got them. I mean, it takes probably longer than 10 minutes, but if you're speedrun some pancakes, I don't care. I'm, <laughs> I'm not a fucking cop, go for it. <laughs> I think it sounds good. There's there you can get pre-made pancakes. Yeah, like well, uh, uh, I know it's not the same. It's, it's not the good. same. They're not made with love. Oh, love's an important ingredient in pancakes. Okay, fair. Yeah, I'm gonna have to learn how. To learn I mean, I can insert some love into the pancakes, but nobody wants that apparently for some <laughs> reason. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I, I sh adorable. I'm adorable. Yeah, <laughs> adorable. Oh, is that what you're calling it? <laughs> I'm sorry, everybody. This, Welcome to this my, is my stream. girlfriend, everyone. <laughs> yeah. This this is this is what I talk to every day. <laughs> every day, every fucking day. I'm sorry. No, I like it. It's oh. Cute. Aw. You're adorable. <laughs> Depends on what type of love you're injecting into them. It does, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alright, I'll be right back. I gotta get some... I gotta get that controller, brush out my hair, probably maybe grab a food and refill my water, so... I yeah, to... I gotta refill mine too, yeah. anyway. Okay. I will s we'll meet back here in 10 minutes. Yeah. Okay. If we... If you're late, the bus leaves without you. <laughs> okay. Bear be... Yeah. Bye.